here, welcome to the channel if you found it. We have death on the bottom of the deck, being nurtured by an angel. So even death dies. Hmm. Change even comes to those that cannot. Overall energy, as the wheel turns, so let's dive into this zodiac reading. So again, hey everyone, it's cute, and let's dive in. Aries. The Six of Wands victory comes for those that have an open heart. Uh, Taurus, about to snuff the light out of what couldn't. The Page of Cups, nurturing the young and showing them how to love. Ten Cups of Dreams to fill that chalice of life there. And the doors open up there as one gets victory. Justice comes once that light and that candle is snuffed out. And the world opens up for anybody that drinks from the cup. Eight pentacles of the hard work it takes to get to your dreams. And the hermit shines the light through the doorway. Ten swords come to an end. Those things that needed to be snuffed out. And it brings balance in the end. As the queen of swords wields truth, but wants to wield their heart again. Stepping you to your destiny. It's... It's divine timed and will lead to your ultimate dreams and a transformation. So if you're in a dark space, look for that well of water. And Q's got you. Mm. Nine cups. Who's on the bottom? High Priestess. Mm. Boom. With the sun crossing it. Mm. Learning from those despairing moments as we dials into them. So... Let's pick all this up and toss out three cards real quick and just be ready to move on to our Tree of Life reading as the Knight of Pentacles with its reliability and honor brings a morning star, not a devil or a fear, to make a choice. So the morning makes a choice happen for those that are mm, integrous. And it brings a solid, stable new beginning. It's been slow time coming as they finally come in out of their head of the eight swords and reach into the past and grab what nourishes them as they have judged it as the portal, the way to fulfillment. So if you're in a dark space, look for those miracles. And Q's got you.